All right, now if you were using UEFI tool, you would click on the descriptor region so we can start understanding this stuff instead. So next up, back in the map, it told us that offset hex 40 is going to be the region portion of the flash descriptor. So how do we interpret it? Well, we interpret it like this, flash region zero, like so, zero. And this is basically just a placeholder telling you that the flash descriptor region starts at offset zero. And although it has a limit of zero, it's, that's just because it's always hard coded to end at FFF. So it's always a four kilobyte region. Next region is region one, which is the BIOS region. And so if we interpret bits zero through 12, so we got eight bits from here, and then the next four bits, little Andean flipped around, what you're gonna have is hex 600, but this is once again one of those bits 24 to 12, and so it actually corresponds to 600000. So the start of the BIOS region is at six megabytes, and the limit of the region taken from here, these 12 bits, so eight bits from there, four bits from there, so it's BFF, and then for region limits, you always fill in the last significant 12 bits with Fs. So the region limit is BFFFFF, which is right up to the region range of C000, which is 12 megabytes. So basically, this thing goes from six megabytes up to 12 megabytes. So that is the end of the flash chip. So the BIOS region, as you would expect, is at the end of the flash chip so that the reset vector properly gets mapped to the top of the four gigabyte physical address range. All right, then the next flash region is the management engine region. Take the 12 bits from here, interpret it, pass it through as the bits 24 to 12, and what you get is a management engine region of 5000. Okay, and what is the limit of that region? Taking these 12 bits, we got 5FF, fill in the least significant 12 bits with FFF, and that means that the BIOS region goes from hex 5000 right up to the base of the BIOS region. So the BIOS region starts at 6 megabytes, and the management engine ends at 6 megabytes minus 1 byte. So there you go, those two things are adjacent and taking up a big chunk of the flash chip there. Then the next region is the gigabit ethernet region. Again, grabbing 12 bits for the base. That gives us a base address of hex 1000. And then we get the bits for the limit. And the limit is for FFF, and that is right up to the management engine region, right? So in total, we have the flash descriptor starting at offset zero, and then going for always a hard-coded hex 1000 worth of bytes. Then at the next available spot is the gigabit ethernet starting at hex 1000, ending at hex 4 FFF. So it goes right up to the management engine. Management engine goes from hex 5000 all the way up to 5 FFFF, which is right up to the BIOS region. And then the BIOS region goes from six megabytes all the way to the end of the chip at 12 megabytes minus one byte. Now there are other regions to consider here. Specifically, this hardware does support the platform data region, but we can see that this is filled in with what look like the magic invalid values to basically say this is not being used. That's good because there's no more space on the flash chip. All the space was taken up by all of these regions. So it says if the platform data region is not used, the region base must be programmed to one FF, F, and indeed it is, and the limit to zeros, which indeed it is. So platform data region not used on the Optiplex 7010.